CERN Expansion Packs helps you get the job done quickly and correctly thanks to its intuitive installation. That's why today we're going to walk through how to secure a connection using the Power Expansion Tool in just five steps. We'll also include some troubleshooting tips at the end. As you can see, we're using the new Zern Interlocking Expansion Head. This Zern Patent Pending Tool Head features interlocking teeth and a blunt nose, which help prevent flat marks and ultimately leak paths inside the pipe. It also allows for the PEX pipe to evenly expand into the tool. Before all else, check your tool to confirm you have the appropriate size expander head. It's an easy thing to overlook, so it's a good habit to form. All right, it's still not installation time. You always want to prep the expansion tool before using it to protect the equipment. Wipe the tool thoroughly clean, then lightly lubricate the tool's cone without letting any get inside the piping. Lubrication between the cone and expansion head slows down excessive wear. If you're installing with more than one tool, do not interchange the expansion heads at any point. Now you're ready to cut your Zern PEX piping. Do so at 90 degrees. Make sure it's a square, burr-free cut, so you do not crush or damage the piping. If it's uneven or jagged, start over for a proper connection. Slide the PEX ring onto the PEX piping until you reach the stop tabs on the ring. When installing the pipe onto the expander head, pull the trigger of the power tool. Expand and retract while allowing the tool to rotate and walk itself into the pipe. Reference the operator's manual for the appropriate number of expansions per pipe size. Insert the fitting until it contacts the stops on the fitting. Hold until it's secure. After 45 minutes, pressure test using a Zern PEX or other approved pressure gauge. If the power tool is not rotating, refer to the operator's manual for troubleshooting. In the meantime, here are a few practices to avoid when making your connection. Don't forcibly hold the pipe. Instead, allow the tool to walk in and rotate itself. Don't over or under expand the pipe. Carefully watch your power tool to ensure it's rotating. These pointers will help prevent leak paths and bad expansion markings like this. Thank you for walking through our steps. We hope you found it useful. To check out our full PEX portfolio, including crimp, visit our innovation page at zern.com.